Alright guys, welcome back. My name is once again Tetra Ninja, and we are once again playing Uncharted 3 Drake's Deception. And, oh, that was a leap of faith. I did not know if I could actually grab that, but I really didn't see another option to get in there. And in the last episode, we lifted the key off our friend Sully, and now we're going back into the museum to get that case. Into that case, anyways. Look at all the textures they use, man. It's so pretty. Going up by the looks of it. There we are. Controls are good. Looking good so far. There it is. Oh. That's not what I wanted to do. Come on. There we are. Get a nice little backswing here. Nice grab. Oh, that was close. Nice grab. There's our window. Get in there. He's got something. Thank you. All right. Oh, hey, we're in the room already. Open her up. Whoa. Oh, damn it, kid. Why, Victor, look who it is. The filthy little stray that made off with your wallet. Ah, shit. Come on, son. You haven't got a chance. Just hand it over. Now, the ring. What ring? <laughs> Catherine! Who do you think you are, boy? You're nothing but a filthy, cast-off little beggar. You're not fit to touch these objects. What the hell do you think you're doing? He's just a kid. Stop him! <laughs> <laughs> Stop that boy! Get away! Holy crap. Ah shit, did I want to go up or down? Ring. Hopefully the up was the right decision. Come on, get up there. Break the door down. Oh no. Oh god. He's heading for the roof! Not knowing what's gonna happen in front of me is kinda. Oh fit, go get in there! Oh shit! Go, 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 go! Let go! Come on, come on, come on. Get away, get away. Oh, God. Crap. Who the hell are these guys? Come on. Uh oh. Come on. Keep running. <laughs> these things so suspenseful, I can't see what's gonna happen in front of me. There we go. Oh, what the hell? My thought is exactly. Ah! Yes. Oh, God. Yeah, oh. Go! Up. Oh. Ah, oh, shit. Come 
Come on, drop that. Oh, thanks, Sully. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Up, up. That's where we're going. Oh, he almost got me. Oh, shit. Uh. <laughs> That's going to work. Ah, got damn it. it. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Excuse me, coming through. Sorry about that. No time to search for collectibles. I don't like this. Ah, We've got him. Keep going. Oh, nice. Excuse me, coming through. Oh shit. Sorry about that. No time to search for collectibles and treasures. Go, 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 go. Sully's in the back or anything. Oh no, I want to go here. Swing up. You're gonna fall through. <laughs> oh god. Getting shoes to that. I'm just a kid. Why are you sh Oh no. Go this way. Look what we have here. <laughs> Whoops. You all right? What are you shaking for? Just close your eyes. This won't hurt a bit. Okay, kid. You can relax, kid. We're safe here. Go on. Suit yourself. You don't want it. What do you want from me? Hmm. A little gratitude would be nice. I did just save your ass back there. Thanks. But what's in it for you? I mean, you're a crook, right? <laughs> you gotta have an angle. <laughs> you are one piece of work, kid. What's your story, anyway? Look, mister. No offense, but I don't even know you. Easily remedied. Victor Sullivan. This would be the part where you introduce yourself. Okay. Suppose you tell me what's so special about that ring. It belongs in my family. I'm just taking it back. Passed down from Francis Drake himself. That's right. I don't know how to break this to you, kid, but Drake didn't have any heirs. No children. Well, not with his wife back in England, anyway. <laughs> okay, good point. Let me see it. Come on, kid. If I was gonna take it from you, I would have done it by now. Thank you. So, what is this? Parvis? Mem Sick Parvis Magna. It means greatness from small beginnings. That was his motto. Yeah? You see, Queen Elizabeth gave it to him in 1581, when he got back to England after circumnavigating the globe. That's when she made him a knight. Well, you sure as hell didn't learn that on the streets. How's a kid your age know Latin? The nuns sort of insisted on it. Ah, uh, so like a boarding school. 
That's a nice word for it. Okay, then. So what was all that business with the ring and that astrolabe thing back there? Why don't you tell me? You're the one working for him. Look, kid. A client wants something, I obtain it. For a price. I don't ask any questions. It's just a job. Look pretty friendly to me. Yeah, hey, well... Anyway, I'm pretty sure I'm fired. Okay, look. First of all, that was no astrolabe. It's some sort of decoding device. Check this out. On his way around the world, Drake sailed through the East Indies. Only he says that it took him six months to get from here to here. Yeah, so? So it doesn't add up. He was way too good a sailor for that. It would have taken him a month. Tops. He was hiding something. Something big. How big? Like secret mission from the Queen big. Like millions in plunder treasure that hasn't ever been recovered big. That big? That big. And that decoder has something to do with it. I would bet my life on it. Oh, swell. And Marlowe's got it. Won't do her much good without the key. So it's a stalemate, then? For now. <laughs> so you still haven't told me what your name is? And you still haven't told me what you want from me. Okay. Look, you got talent, but you got a lot to learn. You stick with me, and I'll teach you a few things. Thanks. But I'm doing just fine on my own. Yeah, clearly. What do you say we uh, try this again? My friends call me Sully. Nathan Drake. Nate. Drake, huh? Okay. I see great things in our future, kid. Great things. <laughs>